Hi, my name's Hugo. In my last video, I caught up with my friend Declan Stacy, who's a professional diver and used to do gymnastics as well. And he showed me a few of the floor routines he does to train for diving. Now in this video, he's gonna try out rock climbing. If you're a beginner climber, you could also learn from this because I show Declan a few techniques including heel hook, toe hook, drop knee, and rock over. I hope you enjoy it. So when you're climbing, if you're reaching with your right arm, you want to push with your right leg. Yeah. Um, and so, because otherwise you can like... See, this is what happens if I do it the other way. And it, it just, it's just not as smooth, Basic. you know? Yeah. Yeah, if, but if you reach, if you push with that leg in, it just, it's a lot smoother. And also, um, so if I'm reaching for this hold, I don't want to go here and just try and pull up like that. Yeah. Puts, um, so what you do, have your foot there, rock over your foot, and then stand up. Yeah. Can so do you want to try that? Yeah. Um, no. So you rock over your foot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you want to be like sitting on that okay. right above it and then stand up okay. instead of trying to just steal out here and just trying to pull up. Yeah, that's better. Nice. And something else, it's just called a drop knee. Um, and so it just gives you a little bit more extra reach and it brings you in closer to the wall. Yep. So you have your foot up, twist your knee in, and then you can, so you like side onto the wall and then you reach for the hold. And that especially helps on overhangs because okay. yeah. it brings you in close to the wall. If you're out here, it's going to be a lot harder, but yeah, but it brings you closer. Nice. So try doing this aqua using those techniques. So dropping your knee um, and rocking over your foot. Nice. Get your other foot up. I just felt it the yeah. Right way. Yeah, so that's why you wanna have you wanna have your right foot up before you reach for that hold. Okay. So where was my right foot? Yeah. So it was no, it was just down here. And you had your left foot here, but you wanted to get your right foot there. Oh, okay. Yep, one. Nice. So again, if you're reaching with your left hand, you want to drop your left knee and push with that. Um, and so another thing is called heel hooking. And that's when, so instead of getting your toe on the hold, um, you put your heel on it like that, point your toe, and then you can lean over it like that. Okay. So if you, if it was like this and you try to put, put your toe on it, it's just, yeah. So you put your heel on it, point your, to point your toe, and then cross. Well, you can do it, um, you can go up as well, that like that. So you just put your heel on it. Yeah. Ah, so which one should I do? Um, so okay, try this green. That's got a heel, and see if you can find where the heel is in the screen. Wow. 
see the hook?
So just just again, so when I get to here, this hue, yeah. like that. No, so first you get this one, and then get this, and then put here on that, and go back, two hands, twist in, and go to the next one. So Declan, um, how did you find climbing? What did you think of it? Um, it was pretty hard. It was pretty tough. Uh, I think my forearms are going to be, you know, pretty sore and yep. that sort of thing. But um, but no, I enjoyed it. You know, it's a tough sport. I think I will stick to the diving, stick mm -hmm. to being in the pool and stuff like that. But um, I have a lot of respect for what you do, and you need a lot of strength and technique and that sort of thing. So, but hey, it was good fun. I'm yeah. glad I tried it. Did you think uh, your diving like related and helped you with climb the climbing? Um, I guess so, like maybe a little bit. I mean, not that I was that good and that sort of thing, but like I guess maybe um, with the, I guess the, the physical strength and that sort of thing, it, it would help a little bit. Um, but apart from that, I don't know. I'm not too sure. Yeah. And what did you find was the hardest part of climbing? Oh, the hardest part of climbing, I think it's the, just the muscular endurance mm -hmm. part of it. Uh, I found that personally, I've never had overly strong forearms, even when I was a gymnast. I think they were a lot stronger when I was a gymnast to now. Now that I'm a diver, I don't need my forearms as much. Um, but still, my forearms have always been weak. So I found that when I was climbing, they were getting fatigued really quickly. And then I was having to try and like shake them out. Uh, and that was really challenging. But um, I would imagine that you would probably you know, have to try and use your legs and that sort of thing. Yeah. Um, uh, like that's the technique side of it that you would learn um, that, that I struggled with. So yeah, so I think, I think that would be the hardest part. Come on. <laughs> 26, how many did you do? 26, 26. 26. 26. 26. Yeah. Well, thanks very much, Declan. Thanks for coming. Um, yeah, it was really good climbing with you. Did good. Thanks, man. Maybe I'll come di diving with you sometime. I'd love to have you come diving sometime, yeah. man. Um, tough sport that you do, but all yeah. the best for everything. Um, may you be an Olympian one day. Yeah, you too. Keep going, dude. Awesome. Cool. Thanks for having me. Yeah. Cheers. So don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you later. Subscribe. <laughs>